Swizz widget. Was that the right word? I can't even remember now. Swizz widget viewers. Swizz widget. Whatever. Anyways. Um, so, we're back with Monster Rancher 3. Um, I have a new CD now. This isn't the one I started the recording with because we saw in the last video it was kind of bugged. So we get their DVDs. Yeah, that's right. I forget about that. But anyway, um, so we'll see how it works because I haven't actually bothered to test it. So we'll all find out if it works or not together. <coughs> Excuse me. Yay! Trampoline is success. So now it should be winter. Yeah. Oh joy, we get to do this again. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I'm not gonna read that anymore. Um, I don't know if I really want to waste any more money on this. I'm gonna do fruit right now. I don't want to spend all of my money on extract. Blah, 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 buy my stuff. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> See you next time. It's like he's got a, a monopoly on that stuff. Seriously. Alright, I really want to check down here. Yes. That was not what I wanted. Ah, uh, I found a large egg. That sounds okay. delicious. I don't remember what it does off the top of my head. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Yes, mushroom. Yay! Five life. That's not actually bad. No kidding. Her eyes were really big. <laughs> Normally when I do this, I, I go to the little noisy halls first, but... Seeing as he only has like one move I care about at the moment, it's not totally imperative that I do this. Plus, I really want to discover more training areas. I'm gonna keep checking that log first, because I know there's one in that log. And then there should be a noisy hall... ...right inside here? No, it's over here. Yeah, it's been a... It's been a week since we recorded, hasn't it? Yeah, almost. I'm sitting here trying to remember where everything is. It's been five days, I think, so... Yeah. I've been busy at work, because... Internet Explorer 9... Yeah. Out. Oh my gosh, it looks just like Chrome. I can't get over it. <laughs> of course, heaven forbid I actually, like, work perfectly, though. I have all these problems with it, but... We'll see. Oh, I better discover something quickly. Why does the camera angle- Ugh! I can't tell where I've been because the camera changes on me constantly. You've been near here. Oh well, I'll just go here. Wow, that was actually a really good haul for the most part. I mean, we didn't lose any stats, did we? Nope. Should we feed him this time? Ooh, fish. Not meat. I don't want to pay for meat. Fish it is. So I guess all the monsters are omnivores. All of them? Well, I think they'd all eat, you know, mushrooms and fish. Oh, I don't know if he, he might be too tired. Let's see. Let's just try. Give it a good old save. My CD's skipping a little, I can hear it. I asked the helper to clean it for me, I don't think he actually did. <laughs> That's okay. I like the desert area, I think that big ol' skeleton is really cool. I wish I had the monster that had that skeleton. I don't, I, I don't know if it's just morbid or not that the whole arena is made out of the skeleton. I just think that's neat. Yeah, I was just thinking that myself. I was wondering what comment I was going to make, but you beat me to it. <laughs> Talto. Oh, crud. I remember the name, but I don't remember what it is. I think it's a tiger. Oh, no. It's totally off its emoji. It's like a desert mochi it's or something? It's a desert mochi. Yeah. The other thing is, I, I didn't realize this until later. Normally when we discuss a monster and its type, we usually say the main and the sub. Even though that's not really, you know, how you describe things in English language, but... Because 
These monsters are sub-region and not sub-monster. I think we're actually gonna go the other way this time. I know it's a little confusing, but we're gonna say like desert mochi. Because that makes Instead way of, like, more sense. Instead of like mochi desert. Yeah, it makes way more sense in this context. Um, yeah. The other thing is, one of my viewers said something to me that I found really interesting and that I did not know. Apparently, if you have less guts, uh, your accuracy goes down for that skill. I'm kind of curious to test that out. Not that I don't believe him, I just never knew that, and I think that's cool. So I don't think I'm going to push his limit. Yay, we won! Woohoo! Galaha. Gal Galaha. Galaha. Hey, he actually managed to win one. Yeah, I know. I can fight better than you! <laughs> <laughs> I like doing that voice for some reason. I don't know if it sounds any different, but it, I definitely have to, to change my voice for that one. I like doing it. Oh man, I wish I had sunglasses on Blink. I don't know what I'm going to put on Blink. He needs something cool. I love that the Tigers actually have an accessory that looks like one of those kegs that goes around the St. Bernards. I love to put it on them. I like the desert music too. I just really love this arena. That's why I really couldn't pass up a, a fight. If it had been any other region, I probably would have skipped this fight, honestly. But I, I can't pass up the desert region. In fact, that's one of my favorite training areas, especially for power-type monsters. I'll probably hang around there a lot when we get there. That was a critical. Yeah, that was a crit. What? Come on, really? Perfect. K.O. I think it took me forever when I was a kid to figure out what K.O. actually stood for. I, just, I was like, yay, K.O.'d him! And I was like... And my mom told me one day it actually stood for something. I'm like, wow, really? <laughs> I thought it was a word in its own right. It just happened to have periods in it. Oh man, I just had this horrible thought. I was like... After we... It was like, you know, we said, uh... Like, K.O., I was like, finish him. <laughs> I'm like, man, that'd be like the worst combination Monster Rancher with like Mortal Kombat mixed together. Aren't they making a new Mortal Kombat? They're always making a new Mortal Kombat. I just know there was this huge sign in the front of GameStop. It was like a hundred dollar collector's edition. I'm like, really? <laughs> Do you really need that? I mean, I can't You're gonna say anything. You're going to rush out and buy it, right? I can't say much about that because I actually buy collector's editions for a lot of things because um, I'm a nerd. I don't know why I have this collector's instinct inside me. Um. Keep going. I was gonna say, because he seems to react pretty well to that. He looks very tired, obviously. <laughs> he was tired. Oh, he's like dragging his hands. Hold on, go back. I want to watch him drag his hands. Uh, uh. Uh, that was like me Friday morning. Uh. Alright, now we'll rest him. Yes, go rest. Okay, and then I actually do want to go to the Festa. I'm tired of being in E rank. Should I just rest again? Mm. Your call. I think I'm gonna rest him again, honestly. I don't really like her her little angry face down in the bottom left for being too hard of a trainer. So happy the Tochikon Fest is this week. Let's enter the tournament at the Tochikon Festa and see how Blink has how strong Blink has become at the Tochikon Festa. Blink is full of energy. Let's save. Hopefully we'll actually get a rank instead of just started. Yeah, that'd be definitely nice. The Festas actually have their own little tournament area, which is, is also kind of cool. I'm, I'm not quite sure how you're supposed to get up there, but it's cool. Tochikon Festa, well, Winter E. Well, I mean, they had like floating islands, so surely they have like floating elevators. <laughs> floating uh, elevators. Oh, is everyone ready? Let's go the Tochikon Festa. Spappy, let's go for the top. You got lucky last time, but not this time. I'm going to win this tournament. 
Uh, for some reason, I thought there was an actual, like, a real announcer. I guess not. Give orders to blink, yes. Maybe the higher ranks. Maybe. Oh, yeah. And the Festa... Every Festa rank has its own music. Um, so I guess I'm not going to talk to this first fight so you can listen to the music. Wow, if I had been that Zoom's trainer, I'd be really mad. Because he had, like, higher accuracy and everything. <laughs> and he missed both times. So Galahad's out. Or not out, but... Oh, yeah. Out. Also, in this Monster Rancher, I, I know this one's more obvious than other Monster Ranchers. I think they might actually replicate it in four, but you'll notice that we have a green circle instead of a blue one. That means that was a KO. Uh, KOs are now worth more than uh, just normal wins, so if we were tied with someone, but we had a, a KO under our belt, then we would automatically win. Nice. So. I don't think they did that in Monster Rancher 2. I can't remember. Yeah, I, I I haven't played Monster Hunter 2 in so long. Although, I was like, I started it and then Pokemon Black and White came out, so I've actually been playing that. Yeah, you'll notice they kept saying fast footwork over to the side. I think he's using that ability to constantly dodge me. Yeah, fast footwork. I don't. He's doing oh, something. How's that? Yeah, but how's that going for him? I have no idea, but it's showing up a lot. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty fast footwork right there. Yeah, we made fast work of him. <laughs> but a ching Wow, we're like just... Yeah, we probably should have done this last time if we're doing this well. Oh well. Yeah, we're easily d rank quality. It was all that power I gave him. Now I'm wondering if we should just go straight through to C, but I haven't seen how they fight yet, so... so uh, have we seen a normal Momo? Because that's what it is. I think we've seen a normal Momo. Yeah, we have. You're right. But I think we fought this exact one already. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Yeah, we fought Kanap before. Why do we have obnoxious speed? We like keep dodging everything. Got me. Maybe they just have really bad accuracy and we're not aware of it. Maybe. Please kill him. Oh no. I'm gonna just stay in the middle because he has no moves there. Oh no! I've been hit. With walnut seeds. Chicken. Do walnuts even have seeds? Walnuts are seeds! They can't have seeds inside of them, can they? I guess not. Just die. There. Yay! So, yeah, we've pretty much KO'd everybody in this tournament and in pretty much all the recent tournaments we've been going to, too. I don't know. Stuart might be a little difficult, although he's not doing too well. Tigers in this game are actually really good. Um... I actually have a tiger I really like, but he's really hard to train. I'd probably train him just because I can. I don't know if it's going to work out, but um, I like the tigers in this game, actually. I don't know why. I don't know if they just have better moves or just, like, they're not bratty. I don't know. And, of course, uh, I'm a little surprised. I didn't think about this the other day, but I haven't given a rant yet about how worms are not actually in this game. Can you transfer them in from previous games at all? No. They've been completely replaced. Apparently, in Monster Rancher 2, they evolved into Beklons um, when they cocooned, instead of just cocooning into something random like they did in Monster Rancher 1. Um, 
so they cocooned into Beklon to take out a Beklon. Well, apparently, people have said, because I, I think I credited about it in the first Monster Rancher, and people were like, well, their reasoning was uh, that they permanently evolved into Beklons. And I'm like, generally, evolution is, you know, connotation of it's better. <laughs> I, I honestly don't think Beklons are any better. In fact, I think they're way worse. Um, I, I, I don't know if I just hate them because they replaced worms or if I just hate them because they're not great monsters. But I've had a couple in the past that have done well. I just, I think I'm just more angry that they took took worms' place. So I'm, I'm, I'm really harsh on them. I, I'm seriously doubting I'll play Beklon in this game, just for that reason. Yeah, so don't really expect it unless you guys really want to see one. Like, I know I, I showed off a lot of different monsters in the first one, but. Oh, yeah, we're fighting. What's her butt? Yeah, yeah but we've already gotten four KOs. The next closest was uh, Kotomo with uh, four wins, but he doesn't have four KOs underneath his belt. Yeah, so there's no way we can lose this. But still, it goes on your record. I can't remember if this Monster Rancher does it so you. Some of the Monster Rangers rec uh, record whole battles as wins or losses, and some record each individual fight as wins and losses. I can't remember which one this one does. I'll have to look mm. at the, uh... I'll have to look at our breeder stats. Not that I'm gonna try to be perfect. Sometimes when I play this game, I try to be perfect. As an extra challenge. But I don't think I really care for this Let's Play. Nah, for Let's Play, no. Yeah, I'll play it normally. 5 KOs. <laughs> Something tells me we're not supposed to be here anymore. I don't think so. They're like, alright, get out of E-rank, go somewhere else. <laughs> He's so cute! He's got like a permanent party hat. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. The champion of the season's Tochicon Festa is Blink! I think this would be good. Yeah, you think? <laughs> I have a feeling it'll win through rank D. Really? Heh. <laughs> you only get 500 gold. It's uh, it's just like Moss Rancher when they don't give you the full prize money for the Festas. It's usually only half what you normally would get. But you get a rank, so it works out. Yeah. No, no, and then the rank gives you access to better tournaments, which yada yada yada. Blink, we won! Do you want to say something to Blink? Uh, keep going. I think he'll do his best next time too. Where should we feed Blink? Uh, Actually, at a good stopping point. Let me feed Blink first. Yes, yeah, changed to bad. Very satisfied. Oh yeah, let's just stop it here, and then we'll talk to this young lady in the next video. Bye guys. Bye guys.